Hello, I am the Flawless Walrus, and welcome back to our Let's Play of The Messenger. And last time we were going through this watery maze, and uh, I decided that I was going to um, basically start trying to chart it, like with the exits and things like that. But I think I did actually accidentally solve it. Like, I ended up in this part, and then anytime that you go, like, the, the, the maze is just gone now, I think. Um,. I spent about 20 minutes, like, drawing each one now, <laughs> so it feels almost like a waste of time, but... Oh, okay. Sure. <laughs> Just got an achievement for it, so... Okay. Which makes me curious what this is gonna be. The Sunken Shrine. There's a lot of, uh... Hmm. I did not expect this to be a full area, but this will probably be where one of the, uh, um, where one of the music notes is then, if it's a whole new area. Oh, cool, I unlocked this then for, uh, right, this, so that's probably what's gonna happen here, too. From the other side, yeah. Okay. Here too. There's actually quite a few areas that I straight up haven't been in. Um, do I want to go there? No, let's let's go to the Sunken Temple. New stuff. Everybody loves new stuff. Okay. Let's start with up. Well, I said let's start with up. There we go. Ooh. I like a chat about this place. Yeah. Current area. This place looks ancient. Oh, you noticed? We're not clear on what the Sunken Shrine really is, other than the ruins of the legend long forgotten. It's gotta be the truth. The prophet thinks it was built to worship legendary heroes who ascended to the Guardian Gods. Whoa. Crazy, right? I mean, who becomes a god? We fell into the sea now, anyway. But apparently, their power is the stars. Anyway, if our calculations are correct, you should find a museum now somewhere in here. Good stuff. Oh, those guys are looking pretty gnarly. Oh, really? I can check those things far. One hit, though. Not bad. Let's not go up and immediately get crunched. Depending on the time. There. Hey, uh, around. That's kind of close. Can I hit you from here? Oh, I see. I kind of sprung out of the water really fast there. We got dolphin dive. I can go up from here though. I'm assuming that it's that chunk in the middle probably has to be the mast. So let's get that and go back. Aha! Uh -huh. Oh, almost there. Nice, I can afford the uh, durability upgrade now. Always worth it when you get one of those. Oh, well, that's what I need to be in anyway. Oh, stream. Pushing me forward. Spikes is bad. No, that's bad. <laughs> yeah, I was kind of in a fucking no-win situation there. Oh, there's health in here. And 
and shinies. The two best things to be in water. <sighs> Damn, that was interesting though, because when I went to the surface, it just immediately jumped me like all the way up. I wasn't able to kind of be hovering at the surface. I feel like I've been able to before. Going, but okay. I didn't just find the boss room by accident, did I? But I can get that durability now. No uh, new chat, but there we go. So now, I think that means it's things like the spikes and the uh, swingy asshole things will only do one now, too. What's down here? Oh, fuck. Looks like there's gonna be a way up. Probably in the future. not die repeatedly. Got one more hit left in me, basic burn. No, I think that is actually still... still a fair amount of damage. I think that did more than... more than one. Oh. There was health there the whole time, apparently. Okay, so now we're going back to the left. But going the right way only after I've gone all the wrong ways, which is kind of what you want in, in these games generally. Helps cut down on backtracking. Also, fire in the water. Thankfully, those guys are only one damage each. Oh. God's weird going from water to none. Oh, come on. I got fucking aim over there. Nope, you died. Oh, could I have gone down from there? No, okay. That would have, in fact, been death. You got the light foot, Tabby. You now run on liquid surfaces by holding right trigger. Just make sure to keep moving. Summon the chakra to your feet. Oh, cool. So that means that it's actually an active decision with... Oh. Okay, I got it. It means that it's actually an active decision whether you go under the water or on top of it. Interesting. I was pondering to myself, why do they make you um, hold down right trigger for it, right? Because that's kind of like making a conscious effort to do so. But then, yeah, what if you just want to go in the water? Oh, it's a damn good thing that I got those first. See? get the right order of things. Because if I had come here, I would have been absolutely boned if I didn't have those tabby. You gonna talk to me about the tabby? Nope. So what, like 2,000 is my next, uh... Next goal for the gems? Ah, shit. Yeah, still do so much damage. Well, 
this time right here. Snipers. Aggressively firing those things, not letting me get down to the platform. Technically speaking, I don't need to care that much about the damage as long as I survive to the, uh, the health pickup, because I'm pretty sure that basically full heals me at this point. Oh, yeah, but then again, I do have to worry about getting absolutely sniped by these guys. Really? I really don't think I hit that one, but sure, let's go with it. Alright, we'll be careful. If I must. Oh, God. That 
totally works the other time. Probably the best way to avoid those tridents is to... Okay. There we go. Just get onto it, and it goes so much easier. That should not have caused the fucking problems that it caused. <laughs> I have no idea why that caused me to stall out so hard. Now I know the method of not failing horrendously at it. Which is, don't be attached to your shuriken. Uh, uh, do they have a different sound effect in the past? Present? I made that snipe, but we take off. Oh, come on. Try to pass through it and then maybe stand up. Okay, so we're not trying to get back. What we actually want to do is uh, keep going here. get there when Oh god, these little perfect bastards. Two of them are bad. So going left there is another path, but I feel like that's gonna be Right. Because the other one is in a full on other path. Maybe. Let, let's actually go right first. Classic platformer logic. Always go. Oh. Wait, what? Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah, this is definitely a secret area. God, I'm gonna have to remember to hold down right trigger when I'm on uh, water at least now. And to keep moving. Keep moving, keep moving. Come here, you. Give me health, give me health. I'm wondering 
why there's the... The past and future one there. Fucking, they are so crazy at sniping. I just have to make sure to like not leave fucking any of them alive. Cause they can just get you from anywhere. Holy shit, though. Stop it! Okay. There we go, some health. Always appreciate the health. Okay, that'll be tricky. Never mind, it won't. Just a modicum of speed or golden. Yeah, okay, so it probably has to do with the big yeah. Yep. Makes sense. Oh, interesting. Going this way actually just puts me back on track for the uh, other place. What's down here? Yeah. Lots of shinies. Everybody loves the shinies. That makes some sense. Yeah, more shinies. Can I put the other one in? Yeah. Boop. The other sock is empty. I am quite aware. Let's go over here then. Door is the big thing, but I wonder if uh, this is an optional area or. Mm. Oh, yeah, it is. Cool. We take the loads of money. Yeah, let's do it over here. Okay. Go 
should have done that right away. Okay, so I think over here is actually the last uh, section I gotta do then. Always check. Ah, get bypassed water. And bonk. There we go. Okay, now where are we going? Uh, back over here. Well, I just happened to get a good base with that. The shiny. Uh, oh no, wizard's here. Oh, shit. And you have to constantly be aware of the, uh, the water and keep moving. Get under it. That works too. I'm not picky, as long as I don't die. Okay. Solidly sized area. Okay, well, we got a clear optional area down there. Will it just tip? Oh, no. That is ground. That's a good way to, uh, to prevent sinking. It's basically like jump, kind of double back, and then go the same way. Huh. That was complete. Nice happy fast track. Interesting, actually, because usually with a water dungeon, um, it's usually some of the worst received parts of a game, because water tends to be very slow. Um, but in this way, the the item that you get with the tabby there basically makes it so that you can bypass the water entirely. Ah, thank you for the free health, gentlemen. the future fact. <laughs>
like haste is the reason why I die 90% of the time. Because I'll see, like, an enemy and I'll just be like, Yeah, that looks like something I can deal with right now. There we go. And we just crawl our way back up. I think we're actually done this place. So... Now it's basically going to be finding out whether there's a boss here or not. Answer is... probably. But that is something that we're going to find out on the next one, because we are uh, running next room. Alright, you guys have yourselves a great one, and I will see you next time for whatever boss is going to be here. Uh, early prediction. I don't know, a, a crab? Let's go with a crab. It's usually one of those two. Alright, have yourselves a great one.